Local historian and sixth generation El Dorado County resident Guy Nixon reflects on county history and environmental issues with a style all his own. You're uh, here on uh, Listening Hill in Greater Chicken Flats. No, it has nothing to do with the chicken being flattened. And the hill that you can see that's starting to yellow out there on the left hand side goes up pretty steep to a point. That's Mount Murphy. And just as an interesting thing, in, when you're at Coloma and you're at the crossing to go across the bridge to either Bain or Mount Murphy Road, there's a cannon sitting there. That cannon was uh, taken by the Russians when Napoleon had to beat it out of Moscow. He waited in Moscow for the Russians to, for their surrender and the, the Russians wouldn't surrender. So among the things that he left, one of them was that cannon. And it sat in Moscow for some time and apparently they then thought they might need it in fighting the Yakutsk. So it was drug all the way out to Siberia to fight the Yakutsk. And by the time it got there, the Yakutsk war was over. So they took it on over to Vladivostok on the Pacific Ocean. After a little bit, that cannon was taken up to their colonies in Alaska, and apparently it sat at Sitka for about five years. Then the Russians thought they might need that for armaments in case they wanted to protect Fort Ross against the Spanish or the British or somebody. So down to Fort Ross it went. Never got to shoot at anybody, but Sutter bought the, the fort lock, stock, and cannon barrel. So he drug it down to Sacramento. Well, he decided that Marshall might need that in case the Indians were going to attack him. So they drug it up to Coloma. Well, the Indians didn't attack Marshall. They were helping Marshall run the sawmill. So the only appreciable thing it did is they drug it right up to the top of Mount Murphy. And when somebody saw the mail stage coming across a hill from Folsom, they'd fire the cannon off so the folks here at Listening Hill and other places, mother mining camps, would know that their mail was coming. And they could get down to Coloma about the same time the stage had arrived so they could get the mail and bring it on back. That's about the only thing that cannon ever did firing a shot after Napoleon lost it in Moscow was to signal, you have mail.